Hello, this is a short video to show you how you can bring your SAP data directly into Tableau Prep using the Tableau Connector for SAP from DVW Analytics. So let's start in Tableau Prep to see your SAP data landing there. I'm going to start with just a straightforward file at first and we're going to use this file to hold parameters which will define exactly which data we want from SAP. You can see here we've got given company code and several years. Let's add a script now to our flow and it's this tab pi script which allows us to connect back into SAP. You can see I've pre-prepared this, I'll show you how to create this later, but I'm going to choose my script and give the function name get data. And at this point Tableau fires a call back into SAP to do just that. And as you can see, we've got the data. This is the data actually from BKPF table. And you can see that we have a response that corresponds to the filters we apply for fiscal year and company code. And I can add any filter I want from the BKPF table. Just to show you how versatile this is, I'm going to add another script. And this time I'm going to point at the BSEG table, the line item table for the accounting documents. And I'm going to use the output from BKPF as the filter for my BSEG table. I go through the same process, I get data, but now I'm passing data from BKPF into the BSEG call. So I'm filtering specifically for the data I want, which makes this really efficient. I can now join them using Tableau Prep. If I adjust this join so that it represents the key of both tables, so add accounting document number and company code, we can see that the table joins nicely now and we have the header data from BKPF together with the segment data from BSEG. And when we add an output, you can see how that data is combined nicely for downstream analytics. Now, just to show how flexible this approach can be, I'm gonna add in a clean step in order to adjust the input to my initial BKPF table. So for instance, we can change maybe the company code from 1000, the initial input, and overwrite that with 3000. We can be specific about which um, of our filters we're interested in and keep just one of them. Equally, this could be a calculation for today's date so that we could get just today's data and we can be very flexible about the data we bring. When we make those changes, we rerun the flow and as you can see, the data that is extracted is exactly what we want and is controlled entirely from within Tableau Prep. Now let's see how easy it is to achieve this using the DVW Analytics tools. You can see in the diagram here on the right hand side where we've just been, Tableau Prep. And from here we called a tab pi script, which was generated together with the connectivity into SAP in our TCS console. Let's take a look at that now. The console runs on my desktop and you can see here the two connections that I've already created for BKPF and BSEG. And if I open one of these configurations, you can see just how easy it is. We can connect to different types of data as you can see here and also different systems. In the parameters, we simply look for the table we're looking for and add filters in order to preview the data that we're interested in. If we switch to the data review, you can see that preview here. It contains the data filtered as we wish and only the columns that we've selected. So it's as simple as that. We can save our connection here and then go on to the second part, which is to generate the Tableau Python script, which can be done very easily within the console itself. We select our connection, we say our target, which is Tableau in this case, and we can even add parameters so that we can filter the data and you can see that in the code that is generated for us. We simply save the script and as you can see here, we can then connect to any type of SAP data we wish. And that can include BW query data, as we've seen tables, but also here SAP T code data. So data directly from an SAP T code into Tableau. Now up to this point we've talked about desktop, but equally can we use our connectivity on server versions of Tableau. In fact, our console has its own server version where we can publish connections and make them available to the wider landscape. And as you can see here, it's as easy as right clicking the connection and sending it to the remote server. And you can manage those remote connections from the same console as you can see here. The beauty of this, of course, is that now we're using the TCS server console, we can share those connections, those scripts, with the TabPy server centrally to the rest of your organization, both at desktop and server level. And from within server, the flows and the data sources you create can be used as a centralized resource for the rest of your organization. So I hope this video has given you some insight into how SAP data can be integrated into your Tableau environment. And if you'd like to see more, please visit our website at dvwanalytics.com.